Using implants to support a bridge is an excellent way to replace missing teeth. Like other bridges, a dental bridge uses abutments for support and to hold it in place. Dental implants are small titanium cylinders that are surgically inserted into the bone of the jaw to replace the roots of missing teeth. Artificial teeth are attached to the implants and can be used as part of a bridge. Placing a bridge after teeth have been lost can prevent a chain reaction of problems that could affect your entire mouth. Teeth need each other for support. When a tooth is lost, the biting forces change on the teeth next to the space, and they shift. When a tooth no longer has anything to chew against, it begins to extrude out of the socket. You can eventually end up losing it, too. When your bite is slightly off, it's common that one tooth may hit sooner than the rest. This causes undue stress on the involved teeth, and they begin to flex. It is this continual flexing and stress over time that causes the enamel to separate from the inner dentin layer, forming the familiar-looking notch that we call abfraction. As your bite changes, it gets harder and harder to chew your food, and you may get damage to your jaw joint, the TMJ. It's much harder to clean teeth that have shifted. Harmful plaque and tartar collect in these new hard-to-reach places, causing cavities and the permanent bone loss that comes with gum disease. A partial denture is another way to solve the problem of missing teeth, but there are several advantages to an implant-supported bridge. You get to avoid the clasps and metalwork that come with a partial denture, and an implant can help stop the continuing bone loss that begins when teeth are removed. Using dental implants to support a bridge is an excellent way to replace missing teeth.